All right. So you've been learning how to code for one week, there about now, and you're probably almost done with the fundamentals, or you're probably out for you're maybe even stuck in between. That is what I wanna talk about with you today, basically dealing with tiredness when you're learning how to code. When I was learning how to code some few years back, I sometimes get tired because I was in a university and I had lectures to attend and I still have life stuff to deal with. All these things cripple around me. Probably you're in a job and you're still learning how to code with that. Traffic, family, all the stress of life. Now, these things are normal. They happen. You get tired, you get frustrated and sometimes feel like quitting and be like, this thing is not for me. I want to tell you, we've all felt like that at one point in time. Even those of us who are professional coders or trainers or anything, we still feel like that sometimes where you feel probably this career is not what you're supposed to be doing when you face some challenges. So it's perfectly fine not to feel okay or to feel tired about what you're learning sometimes. But I just want to tell you today and share with you that Look, the folks who went through this and succeeded, they don't have to wait. They are human beings like you and I. They learned these things, they're good at it. Think of those people who write, who wrote the programming language you're learning. Those are people also. Think of what they did to get there. Don't think they didn't get tired along the way. Every one of us gets tired at every point in time. I've had weeks where I just feel like I don't want to work at all. I don't want to do this coding thing at all. I'm quitting coding, I'm going to another sort of career. Yes, you feel like that sometimes, but I want to encourage you and tell you today, please do not quit. Don't quit on me. I won't let you do that. Do not quit on me. You hear that? I want to see you succeed. Uh, of course, whatever money you earn, whatever things you get out of this, it's all for you, not for me. Uh, so, please do not quit. I want to see you at the top. I want to hear your story of how you're progressing. Please, also, if you're learning this, if you're going on this 100 Days of Code journey, put in a comment below. Let me know your experience. Let me see how we can chat together and, and help each other you know, proceed.